My name is James T. Slater. I was born in Durham, North Carolina, not too far from here, but raised in the tropics of the Panama Canal Zone. Moved here 16, 17 years ago to Nashville, and I play piano, sing, and write songs. I'm a piano playing dude in a guitar town. Shakespeare writing on a piece of paper. Hank Williams singing on an old guitar. Both of them trying to find the words From somewhere up above the stars When I was 14, I wanted to quit the piano. Oh, yeah. I really wanted to quit the piano. I didn't want to play the piano anymore. And uh, my mom in Panama at the time, uh, in Central America, was the one that told me after I was playing a lot of classical, I was getting tired of that, and she said, no, no, you need to, you need to stay on the piano because it's, uh, it's going to serve you well one day. You now, if you've got a song inside you, you know, you, you start to just, every time you sit down, I wanted to do my own, after 10 minutes of playing the classical, I wanted to write my own yeah. thing, you know. And, yeah, any time on the mm. piano or the guitar, and it all pays off in the end, you know, and you be who you are, and do your thing. And, I think it's, it's beautiful to watch it pay off. In my daughter's eyes, I am a hero. I am strong and wise, and I know no fear. But the truth is plain to see, she was sent to rescue me. It's a Grammy nominated song, which you never, when you get in a room like this, think that's going to happen. Right. But by God, it can happen. We've all played, you, you kind of go, okay, it just plays itself almost. It's, yeah. it's, it's what it is. Those are the ones you try to get, you know? Yeah. yeah. Those are the ones you try to get. Mm -hmm. I saw a 60 something Bonneville, ragtop, baby blue. I can't walk down memory lane without running into you. Around the corners of my mind. Where I find my biggest inspiration, I guess, is uh, a sense of home. I sit down at the piano, and that's where the inspiration comes. And I'd say from reading, I'm a huge reader, whether it's magazines to novels to, to whatever, and then travel. Travel to places like Key West or Cuba, places that take me out of my comfort zone, you hear something, you know, like we've all talked about, you hear something, you see something, you smell something, you experience something. So I'd say that's it, a sense of home, travel, and uh, the printed word really inspires me. I'm sitting here stone, the tortilla joes. Nobody knows my name, but that's all right with me. She said adios, so I said hello. I want to be a better piano player. I'm not afraid to be curious and learn. I'm striving to learn every day. It's passion, passion, just that. I'll tell you what, I've been around the world and I have passion and I will be, I will chase that dragon. I will chase it down, chase it, chase it, chase it till I feel like I go to the grave.